What's going on there folks? Earthmaster here jumping in with a quick update video here for an earthquake taking place out here. 6.2 earthquake right there on the uh, Earthquake 3D globe. You can see that large earthquake taking place there in a pretty silent area. We haven't seen a whole lot of earthquake activity out there uh, specifically in this region for quite some time. That is kind of a deeper earthquake as well. 108 kilometers Below the surface, I am not seeing any type of signatures yet on the uh, seismograph stations there, uh, but kind of keeping an eye on it here over to the uh, over here to the left side of the screen. Normally, we'll see a uh, some type of signature from that larger earthquake, but uh, at the moment, no. Uh, taking a look at the USGS map here, uh, we'll go ahead and check out the uh, specifics of this quake here. Well, actually, this according to these guys, there's two of them. 6.5 and a 6.2 you guys see that that's some significant movement right there uh 2340 2343 so we're looking at just about 42 42 seconds worth of time in between these two specific earthquakes here now whether this is a uh, error uh, we'll check that out here real quick and get uh, that set up so this has been reviewed this specific earthquake right here that I just clicked on, the 6.2 earthquake. Um, let's see, let's go back here to where, the, to where this was at. The 6.5, let's go ahead and check that. There is a tsunami statement. It has been reviewed, 6.5. So these are officially two earthquakes here. As far as the tsunami statement goes, we'll go ahead and check this out real quick. 6.5 being recorded near the Philippine Islands. And uh, let's check this out here real quick. I doubt if there's going to be any, but you never know. It's always good to check here, folks. Um, an earthquake with a preliminary magnitude 6.5 occurred near the Philippines. There is no tsunami threat from this earthquake. That is a good thing, but still an area to watch. I mean, I've, I've mentioned this quite a few times in my past videos. We have not seen any type of major movement. Uh, pretty much from about here just to around, oh, maybe just south of this region right here. But it looks like that has changed uh, within the past hour. 2340, 2343. So that looks like maybe about, uh, I don't know, about 15 minutes or so ago. Like I say, I don't see it showing up at all on any of the seismograph stations there. Kind of, kind of, uh, kind of odd. But nonetheless, they have been reviewed by the USGS and it shows uh, that there is no tsunami threat from this earthquake these earthquakes that i should say uh, 6.2 and a 6.5 significant movement though uh, taking place out there just double checking everything out here i don't see any type of uh, issue any type of watch or anything the 6.5 struck uh, looks like just before this 6.2 uh, just just by about 42 seconds or so and then that was quickly followed up uh, by that 6.2 at a little bit deeper level, uh, shaking up the area out there, no doubt. Um, looks like quite a few folks uh, reported filling it there. And that's obviously uh, a given. I mean, that's a, somewhat of a, a large quake, not a mega quake, but uh, definitely a large uh, shaker there for the folks around the uh, Philippines area. All right, folks. We're still kind of monitoring the uh, activity there, and uh, we'll provide any uh, updates if they become available. Looking at the Earthquake 3D globe here, I do not I do not see that second quake on here. You guys see that? I only specifically see a 6.2. So, not for sure what's going on. Like I mentioned, the USGS had it reviewed shows that it's reviewed shows that there is two uh actually now it's just just <laughs> see why i hate to jump the gun real quick on earthquakes there they've downgraded uh, that 6.5 to a 6.2 and got rid of one earthquake um and left that at 108 kilometers below surface so uh looks like that 6.5 was an error which sometimes happens right Especially, um, you know, at different levels of the uh, of the uh, Earth, there they can trigger, you know, some false readings on other stations. But uh, this has been reviewed by a geologist, and um, 
just a 6.2. All right, folks. We'll chat you guys a little bit later. I'll provide a little bit uh, more details a little bit later on in the update video towards this evening.